Hi, my name's Tony Janata, coming to you from Ventura, California. Uh, I wish I was in Scotland with you right now, but I'm happy to be with you in any way I can. Um, thank you, Grace Black, for allowing me to be a part of the Langtown Virtual Jazz Festival. Uh, I'm sharing six videos with you. Four of them are vocal jazz videos, and two of them are promotional videos for the last two projects I did. Uh, one was a documentary and, and one was a children's book. The vocal jazz videos, uh, Echo, is a, a piece of music I wrote uh, after my parents died, and it helped me figure it out. Uh, is It Magic is a tune I wrote when I was in the first throes of a new relationship. Uh, what's the other one? Narcissus and Echo uh, is my take on the Narcissus and Echo myth which is one of my favorite myths. And my take on it is that uh, Echo finds her own voice and becomes, um, becomes herself in the world. And the last one is um, Storms Are Coming. And that's kind of my, my ode to depression. My two, um, my two other promos, one is for a documentary that I did after I got an arts grant. It was a live concert in 2010 that put together jazz improvisers. They played backup band to the homeless in my community. This right here, I hope you can see it. This is Voices of the Homeless, and it's where jazz improvisers help the homeless tell their stories. And the full documentary is up on my website, uh, TonyGenata.com. Finally is my children's book and album that goes with it called My Little Heart Ruthie. And My Little Heart Ruthie was written for children or adults who have been harmed and believe it's their fault. Uh, the illustrations are by Jennifer Moniz and there's a musical suite that goes with it, which I wrote and I narrate, and it features a harp, trumpet, and a rhythm section. I'm on piano and a narration. And uh, thank you to Grace Black, who was the very first person to play the recording on the Jazz Lounge. So Scotland, I hope I see you soon, maybe next year. Uh, and in the meantime, this is Tony Janata coming to you from Ventura, California, wishing you well, and hope you have a wonderful Langtown Virtual Jazz Festival. Bye for now. I wrote this tune after I lost a, a few people in within a year and a half, and this was my way of uh, working it out. This is called Echo.
If you're now my echo, sorrow in reply. If I memorize your tone, I won't feel alone. I might not even ask you why. Beyond stars. And sky, we will harmonize, and I'll never feel alone. So if I listen, would you say that you can hear me far away? So if I grieve, I might believe that you. If you're now my echo, sorrow and reply. If I memorize your tone, I won't feel alone. I might not even ask you why. Feel alone, my echo. Is it magic? Will it fly beyond the clouds, past the crowds, sailing through the sky? This is precious. This is rare. A tender gift, suspense. In the air, it looks like love to me. It looks like love to me. We sail, we fly, never say goodbye. Is it magic? It looks.
It looks like love to me. It looks like love to me. We sail, we fly. Looks like love to me. Is it magic? It looks like love to me. The amazing and one of the few jazz harpists around, Carol Robbins. <laughs> On bass, the amazing Granville Danny Young. Uh, this next tune is, I think, just dedicated to all of us. Uh, it is, by the way, I'm a big fan of, uh, of Greek mythology, and this is uh, the Narcissus and Echo myth. As you know, Echo was in love with Narcissus, and he would not look at her because he was too busy looking at himself. And, f and the gods got angry because they weren't being prayed to and admired, so they turned him into a Narcissus flower and they turned her into an echo in the forest. This is Narcissus and Echo. I stare at you you turn away to gaze into your reflection and you don't know of my dismay you only know your Narcissus and Echo 
I don't need the glory I got my tune You can't keep your damn story It's not a game wrapped up in shame. You only know your reflection. Now I'm a breeze lost in the trees. You only know your Jump off the cliff now I swim in the ocean No more rock fool For elixir of potion Narcissus and that cone I don't need the glory I got my tune You can't keep your day story
Granville, Danny Young. Hello there, my little heart, Ruthie. Thanks for coming so close to the light. It's adorably clear that you're beautiful, dear. You could light up the darkest of nights. I wrote the book because I was having a hard time in therapy and I just started writing and I wrote 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 a little fantasy about a heart that was isolated and cold and needed some hope. So before you open the page, Ruthie has been wounded and she heals herself. It ends with her flying away with her buddy with lots of music in the background, with their instruments, with the music playing, with the, with the colors being very warm and vibrant. Its purpose is to help and heal. Its purpose is to help heal. I wrote the poem, and for some reason, it needed music, and it also needs illustration. So I had the amazing millennial Jennifer Monez as the illustrator, and then Carol Robbins, a jazz harpist. I'm lucky that she plays on the album. And John Cross, he was the easiest, and he helped me so much with the arrangement. Paul Tavener, the drummer and the recording engineer, and Danny Young, Granville Young. He, he was just, whatever you need, whatever you need, what do you want? To have all of their support is surprising every day. I had no idea when it, was, when it started what it would be. So I think at the end of the day, all I can really say is thank you. creative way of promoting the social discourse regarding the issue of homelessness in our society. <laughs> My first thought was, are you for real? Followed closely by, what a cool idea. Hello, well, she like I've been working all my life. It's like this, we all have to eat. Everybody needs to sleep. Everybody wants to stay warm, you know. Just fighting over having more and more and more, you know. How much, Donald Trump, how much 
can you have till you're happy? <laughs> How much can you have till you're happy? Amen, love you all. Hearing these stories made me very aware of these individuals and what they have been through. You see homeless people all the time, but you don't always get an opportunity to hear what they're about. You know that they're hurting, but we don't get to know where they came from. And this really gave them a lot of value and it gave me a lot of respect for them. Hi, my name is Danny Randazzo and I volunteer currently with Family to Family, which is a nonprofit organization. It's a faith-based organization that feeds um, the hungry of uh, Ventura County. I learned about uh, Voices of the Homeless through this organization and went to the performance. Um, taking two extremely different um, genres, one being homeless and one being jazz music, I mean to put those two together, you know, who knew? Voice of the Homeless was a story being told of why are they homeless, how did this happen, what took them there, what are they like, what's it. So that gave me that experience, that chance to try to paint what I thought worked with that. I tried my best just to be in that moment only, never mind whatever I did in the past or whatever I might do in the future. This moment, this guy is talking about his homelessness, his living on the street. What do I hear from that? What do I feel from that? What color is that? What shade is that? What, you know? Hmm. Uh, yeah, um, my self view, you know, my, my the, the person I see in the mirror, uh, sometimes I don't think about it and sometimes I feel really uncomfortable about having been out on the street, in the world, uh, in my car, whatever. And I hear other people talk about the homeless, there's such a disease on society. Well, they could be anybody. You know, I have to remind myself that that inner, that inner dialogue doesn't reflect everything. Mm -hmm. 